Hi guys and welcome to this week's Alakazam video blog. Right, we said we'll do one when we were on the live this week. We did, so if you saw us on Tuesday, thank you for tuning in. It's our uh, Tuesday live at 2 p.m. every week. And yes, we hit with a vlog this Friday. Fridays are the days that we aim to do the vlogs on, so apologies we missed the last couple, but uh, we've had good reason. Um, people have been ill, not here, and so on and so forth, so apologies for that. But we are back this week with a, with a good one. We are, and later on um, during this show, we are going to be dropping in the trailer to Bliss. If you are watching this on Friday... Um, it's pre-release now. It's pre-release now, yeah. Eight o'clock on Friday, so we're going to play the trailer to this. Um, also, if you pop over to our website, to the product, we've got a unboxing video. Noel was actually in the shop yesterday yeah um and he does an unboxing and shows you exa uh, exactly what it is not exactly exactly it's, it's sean connery <laughs> and james bond eh? Very good. so um yeah so that's bliss so we'll play the trailer for that in a moment um yes our newsletter uh again not quite sure what's happened this month but we all we've all been pixelated yeah and all look nothing like ourselves it's like a little computer game thing this this month um, but the newsletter, for those of you that know, don't know, any uh, physical orders that come in will go out with a newsletter. We do a new newsletter every month and you get a free trick in here from our very good friend and Academy Core Tutor John Carey, as well as all the latest stuff from Alakazam HQ. So that's going out in every order. Now they are limited, so if you don't get one, it means we've already run out. So it's good to get your orders in quick. It is indeed, and we've had a couple of things come in this week. We've had one thing that we've released this week, mm -hmm. uh, which has, well literally, we showcased it on Tuesday uh, on the live, which is a reason to watch. Yeah. And uh, they sold out overnight. And yeah. So these are all handmade. What we're talking about is Bromley's rising card with the new handlings and DVD uh, all inside here as well. The gimmick is absolutely incredible. It is just the perfect, in my opinion anyway, rising card uh, with all the quality that you expect to go with Rob Bromley's name. Um, DVD, where yeah. we filmed our extra handlings routines for it to take this from just being a... Um, a rising, rising card, card yeah yeah to a multiple routine uh, and, it, and it's great so the trailer we're going to drop for that we are so um remember they sold out in 24 hours batch number one batch number two is due in at the end of next week and they are three quarters of the way yeah. already sold. sold so if you want one from batch number two we're going to be getting roughly 100 a week uh for the next few weeks so um if you want one get your order in as quick as you can because as soon as batch two get sold out then you're on the waiting list for batch three which will be another week so get your order in quick if you like what you see yeah but shall we play the trailer let's do it here's a trailer for rising cards <laughs> Rising card is one of the oldest bots in Magic, but in my opinion, still one of the most impressive to watch. I think that Rob Bonnie has got the best version of this, and I want you to see why. Uh, can you mix them up for me? Thank you very much. <laughs> this is where you start going. Yeah. Secret cardist. Yeah, yeah, no. <laughs> That's it. And if you'd like to remove one for me, you can place it face up on the table here. And you're going to sign your name across the face of that card and pass the cards over, and you're going to do the exact same thing. Oh, okay. Thank you very much. Good job. I'll take the cards back. Not too shabby. All right. Lovely job. And one last thing, all right? You're both going to remember a card. You're both going to remember the same card so that if one of you forgets it, you have the card in mind. So, uh, if you wouldn't mind just saying stop wherever you like. Stop. Get that card in your mind? Yeah. You got it? Yeah. So you're happy with this situation, right? 
So I'm gonna give these a little mix. Like so. And Carl will place it down here as well. And basically make this as random and as rough and basically the cards don't matter is what I'm getting at here. Okay? And give these a little mix. And now I'm going to place this into the box so that it's kind of out of my reach, out of everyone's hands. So you can't think that I'm doing anything funny here. Alright? Here's what's going to happen. I just want you guys to think of the cards that you signed. <laughs> just one card floats out. Now here's the thing, right? These are in your hands. You've mixed and shuffled these. There was one card, who got a diamond? That was nice. Yeah. The three? The three, yeah. <laughs> uh, those cards, <laughs> That's right, oh my god. Three of diamonds, right? So let's try this again. You might think that something funny is going on with the box. So check the box out for me. Yeah. That's all fair? Yeah? Yeah. yeah? yeah. Before I take that back, let's go for your one, right? Just think of your card. <laughs> no. That's the nine of hearts, that's your signature. Yeah. And now there's one card left to go. I'm going to put these into the box. There's one card, and this just merely exists in both of your minds, right? I'd like you for the first time to name your card. Queen, Queen of Spades. Queen of Spades. Queen of Spades. But how? <laughs> <laughs> now, if this was the Queen of Spades, is that a good end to the trick? That'd be pretty good. Yeah. That's three out of three. That's amazing. <laughs> That's Thank awesome. You. This is impressive to watch, easy to do, and you are in complete control as to when that card rises out of the pack. You are going to absolutely love this. You're going to receive everything you need to do it straight out of the box. The custom made gimmick, the tutorial video giving you all the information you need. And you can grab yours now. So that was the Rising Cards by Rob Bromley. They are out now, but as we said, they're on pre-order for batch two. So get your order in. And just to say, that is totally self-working. Yeah, absolutely. You get so much mileage out of it for no work, pretty much. Um, and yeah, you know, we, we always, I think uh, Pete said in the past that um, we've got the rights now. You bought the rights to all the Bromley stuff. And, you know, it's all sat there, but, you know, these things take time to really get a good routine together we want to make sure that we both take them out road test them and yeah and i think in this routine and we've devised here it, it builds it's more than just watch what happens and uh, you can get multiple people involved so yeah it really is great the quality you're going to absolutely love so make sure you get in for that next batch if you're interested Cool, and uh, now moving on to the Alexam Academy, there's two things to talk to you guys about. We haven't got a academy proper for a couple of weeks. Um, the next one we're gonna have is Colin Klaus. We'll tell you a bit more about that uh, in a moment. Mm. But next week on Wednesday, yeah, we have a special stealth assassin. I forgot what it was called then. Yes. I was gonna call it an Alexam assassin. No, well, it a, might well be. Yeah, <laughs> a, a stealth assassin assassin masterclass and q and a it's totally free of charge to attend all you need to do is go over to our website find it in the academy section add it to your basket go through checkout it won't charge you anything but it will ensure it's in your account make sure you log in before you do it um, and then on wednesday evening at seven o'clock you can join me some very special guests while we uh, basically show you what the assassin is we discuss the proper way to use peaks, the proper timing, teach you some brand new routines, yeah. um, and go over it. So if you own an assassin, 
make sure you put it in your basket because if you can't make it live as long as you've put it in your basket it will then go into your account and you can watch it whenever you want and what i say is if you don't own an assassin do it as well and, and the reason for that is you might not know what you're missing out on uh, i certainly didn't know what i was missing out on and i you know i've got one now and they are fantastic and the amount of routines you can do with them are insane so if you've never looked into mentalism you're a pure just card guy and you do cards to wallet and that's the only reason you use a wallet uh, i would say still add it to your cart and check it out you might be surprised that uh what you're gonna actually gain from this wallet. So yeah, do not miss that. Yeah, and remember I designed the Assassin to be a 15 to 20 minute mentalism act in my pocket. So we're gonna be going through all of that um, and it's gonna be a great night, it's gonna be a fun night and like Dave said, even if you don't own the Assassin, maybe you've been on the wall, you don't really know what it is, um, but this will give you the full lowdown on what it is, how it works, um, and show you the power of it with regards to the routines you're doing. So, um, that's that. That's the uh, uh, Stealth Assassin Q&A next Wednesday, 7 o'clock. Yep. Um, but also a couple of weeks later, we've yes, got Colin Klaus. Klaus. Yeah. Now, this is a course that is slightly different to the other courses yes. that we've done. It is, you know... Um, we want to basically be able to appeal to everyone and uh, this is something that I think will appeal to a lot of people, you know. There's there's two sides to the coin on people with cardistry, okay, yeah. and some magicians don't like it, some magicians absolutely love it, some magicians love it but don't use it with their magic. Uh, I absolutely love it and, uh, and I do utilise it with my magic and I think what what you're going to learn here are flourishes that are, um, it's going to go from sort of easier up, so it's going to, you're going to progress through it. But also they're going to add to your magic, they're, they're, a lot of them are false. Oh, so they're all false. Everyone all he's teaching So is every false, single yeah. one he's going to teach, although looking fancy, and or, or just sort of adding that extra moment to your magic, they're all going to be completely false as well, which are going to you know, allow for... It's just that extra sort of layer of impossibility. Instead and of just a nice doing a cut, visual piece as well, isn't yeah. it? It's, it's a light, nice bit of um, visual theatre before you go into the to the trick. And I don't care what anyone says, lay people do love it. Yeah. They really do. Just by doing one fancy thing like that, they do love it. And yeah, we always get anyway. I've never played cards with him. Yeah. But what what's cool is, you know, if you get that line, they go, oh, I've never played cards with you, before you've done any flourishing, you go... Really? I don't know why. Yeah. I mean, you know, yeah. you can bounce off that. Um, and it is flourishing. I mean, I've, I've never been a great follower of flourishing for one particular reason, and that is because a lot of the people that I see do flourishing don't seem to do anything with it. Yeah. I, I remember a few years ago, some guy coming in the shop saying, can I show you a trick? And I said, yeah, I'd love to see it. And he'd done a flourish, and I'm still waiting for the trick. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? See, see now, flourishing has become its own thing and cardistry, yeah. and actually there's a lot of cardists out there that don't do any magic whatsoever. It's just the but cards. do stuff that no magician would be able to do. Yeah. Like, they solely, when we are practicing double lifts and uh, seconds and that sort of stuff, they are purely just practicing cardistry. And it's another level hard as well. Yeah. What this is on this course is not mega difficult. It's stuff, some of it will be more challenging, but it will start really quite basic. Um, but if you've ever wanted to add just a little extra something to your um, shuffling or mixing, then I would really recommend this. Yeah, and Colin has handpicked every cut that he's going to teach you. Um, for one, they should be well within the reach of anyone. Yes, they will take a bit of work because, you know, anything like that seems pretty alien when you're doing it. Um, if you've never done it before. But also he's picked them for their uh, usability, i.e. they're not just fancy flash bits of visual they are actually going to add something to your magic with regards to all of them being false one thing i would say as well is i don't think there's a, a better course which is more suited to the academy format mm. um if you buy a flourishing dvds especially the old school ones like the trilogy by dan and dave amazing uh, but explained to music um, yeah. uh, with some subtitles, which I think is one of the most difficult things to learn from because you're like, well, hold on, wh where's that thing to go there? Whereas here, 
the whole idea is it is interactive. If you want um, Colin to go over something again, you ask us. We, we're going to be utilising for the first time our super slow mo camera as well. So that's going to really break down moves. Uh, it's going to be amazing. But shall we let Colin tell us a little bit more about it? Yeah. So, so place. Okay. Place. Here is Colin Klaus. Hi, my name is Colin Klaus, and I'm excited to present for you my course, Why Flourishes. There are so many mixed opinions as to whether flourishes fit into magic or not. I'm a keen believer that they do. I'm a professional magician and I use them in my show reels and in my act all the time. And they really enhance what I do. And I've designed this course to take you from absolute basic flourishing all the way to finger flicking madness. Now this course has been designed especially for magicians because each and every single cut is false. So if you think the flourishes is way out of your comfort zone, think again. Here at the Alakazam Academy, we've got multiple camera angles, an interactive chat room, and best of all, slow motion replay to give you the best possible learning experience. My name's Colin Klaus. Join me for my Alakazam Online Academy course, Why Flourishes. Right, so that's uh, Colin Klaus's Why Flourishes uh, Academy course. And if you pre-book your ticket, you will get it at the early bird price of only $19.99. Yeah, brilliant. Okay, so you can get your ticket now, they're on the site. So before we get onto our last product of the evening, Bliss, yep. we're just gonna mention oh. these, the books of wonder. Now, this is a set of books that came out quite a few years ago. I remember, I, I'm sure I worked from home when they came out. So, actually, it was even before that. I think I still lived in Lewisham. So, wow. I reckon this was 20 odd years ago yeah. that they came out. Um, they went out of print very, very quickly and sporadically. They came back in, there would be a few released. Um, they've just come back in the stock. We bought all the remaining stock from the suppliers and we are now running really low. If you do not own these books, but you have a magic library, these should be in it. They are full of workable material for stage, close-up, parlor, yeah. um, there's card tricks and I'm hoping you know. that uh, you'll save me one for my birthday, because I'm asking for this one, but I just think that these books have been something I've been after for a long time, and he won't stop raving about them. They're great, um, they are great. And he says beyond the magic in here as well, and he says that the the sort of theory that he yeah. has in here is worth the price of the books. So if you've never heard of Tommy Wonder, don't worry guys, you don't need the books, you can save them for me. Uh, no, if, you, if you've never heard of Tommy Wonder, check him out. I mean, even his DVDs are incredible. To see yeah. the guy at work is just amazing. Um, and the books of Wonder are classics, will always be, I believe, classics. So uh, yeah, while you can get your hands on them, why not? And um, they are in stock at the moment. Cool. Apart from this one. <laughs> so now on to the last product we're gonna talk about this week, and that is the Amazing Bliss mm -hmm. by Noel Quarter. Um, we first saw this, it must have been a couple of years ago, because Noel's a very good friend of ours, as you know, and Noel showed us the very first prototype. I think it was, do you know what, I think it was about five years ago, five or six years oh, really? ago. Oh really, Blackpool. Yeah, I remember yeah. sitting in the bar when he came up and, and did it, and he had, he had literally fashioned a unit out of gaffer tape. Yes, he had, yeah. Um, uh, which, yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't advise doing. Um, but, you know, you, everything has to start somewhere and now he's got it all, like, you know, um, injection molded and yeah. it's, it's just perfect. It's such a clever and idea. And do you know what? People don't really realise how much yeah. it costs to get a mould, for yeah. an injection mould. I mean, it's you look at something. I mean, this actually, when you see what it is, you, you actually, I'm, I'm not going to show it on there, but you'll see it on the trailer. You can see it in there. Um, but watch the unboxing because we go into full detail on it. 
Yeah, is that under the products on the site? Yes. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so that will be under the product, Find Bliss on the site. You'll see this very special video from Alexander. It will give you a bit of a history on it and an unboxing so you know what exactly what it is. Um, but when you look at the design that's gone into it, for something so simple, Noel has put so much time and effort to make sure that this not only works flawlessly, but is also something you can work commercially. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And repeat. Yeah, and if you're wondering what it is, it is a very clever, examinal, examinal? examinable, examinable version of a signed bill in Sharpie, uh, yeah. in pen. So shall we take a look at the trailer? Yeah, this is the trailer for Bliss. Imagine a signed banknote disappearing under impossible conditions and reappearing in the most amazing location. Who's got a bank note I can borrow for a moment? Who's got some like sweet uh, folding yeah. cash? Yeah. The big money. What have we got? It's, it's Perfect, that'll do. That door's a starting point. Am I going to get it back? Uh, probably, we'll see how it goes. Okay, I'd like to. Can we get you to put your initials on the note? Yeah. A little squiggle on there would be great. Yeah. Very good. And put the lid back on that for me, then I'll cheat those things. Take that back. Uh, can you put your hand palm down for me for a moment? Okay. And hold onto my wrist for me nice and tight. Hold on to your wrist. Hold on to my wrist. Watch this. Three, two, one. No, I don't like it. Here we go. Oh, now you're feeling that feeling of loss, I understand. I'll tell you what, I'll give you a business card. Put your PayPal details on there. I'll send you the cash tonight. Uh, put your name on there for me for a moment. No? Duffer? No, Duffer. Right, there might be a little bit of a jam. I'm just going to live with that. No. Uh, <laughs> I'm so relaxed, it looks familiar. Oh my god, no way! No way! The gimmick effortlessly vanishes, loads, and locks the bill. It does all the work, but you take all the credit. It's a beautiful item to hold. Um, thing looks sexy, just like me. It'll make magicians smile because of the cute and clever method, but it will devastate your audience as well. I'm Mel Porter. <laughs> and this is Bliss. Right, so that is Bliss by Noel Quarter. You can pre-order those on our website now. Yep, and they are released on, do you remember the day? Uh, I think he said it. 13th, 13th, I think. Yeah. I believe it's the 13th. But it'll be on the site, won't it? Yes. So we spoke about Bliss today. Uh, really excited about this. So yeah, go over to the site for more information. Uh, the Books of Wonder. Really want to get my hands on a set of them. The Rising Card. Currently out of stock, but taking pre-orders for the next batch. So make sure you get yours in. And of course, with every order, while these last uh, will be our newsletter. So I think that covers everything for this week's vlog. I'd say join us next Tuesday for our regular live and hangout at 2 p.m. on Facebook and YouTube. Anything else left to add? Um, no, the new website, well, yes. Why do I say no and then start <laughs> talking? So, yes, the new website is getting closer and hopefully when it's launched, you'll be able to watch our lives on Facebook, YouTube and our website, which cool. will be great for people that don't have Facebook or YouTube. Mm -hmm. um, so that's going to be happening um, soon, very, very soon. We did it with Liam Montiers. We're going to try and do it with all Academy courses now. We're going to allow you to have the first 15 minutes free on selected courses. Uh, most of you know how good the courses are, so you're going on uh, onto them anyway. But for those of you that don't and want like a little bit of a tester or a trial, you can watch the first 15 minutes. Um, the other great thing as well is if you sign up to the Academy Q&A next week, you'll get the actual feel for the Academy because it is going to be treated like an Academy course. We're going to have the multiple camera angles. Yeah. We're going to have the chat room. Um, you're going to see some live performances, some in-depth discussions, and it's going to be a lot of fun. So uh, make sure you get your ticket for that. And the tickets to that are limited and we are over halfway through with them. 
Great. So, um, and that's about it. I have nothing left to add apart from thank you so much for all your continued support. We will see you in all the usual places uh, and probably the next time will be next Tuesday at 2 p.m. on Facebook and YouTube. So have a good day, guys. Hi, my name is Colin Klaus and I'm excited to present for you my course, Why Flourishes. There are so many mixed opinions as to whether flourishes fit into magic or not. I'm a keen believer that they do. I'm a professional magician and I use them in my showreels and in my act all the time. And they really enhance what I do. And I've designed this course to take you from absolute basic flourishing all the way to finger flicking madness. Now this course has been designed especially for magicians because each and every single cut is false. So if you think the flourishes is way out of your comfort zone, think again. Here at the Alakazam Academy, we've got multiple camera angles, an interactive chat room, and best of all, slow motion replay to give you the best possible learning experience. My name's Colin Klaus. Join me for my Alakazam Online Academy course, Why Flourishes.